More than 100 elementary school principals from across the country took part in the National Leaders Convention to discuss issues facing early education. Funding is a big issue. You're going to hear that from all across the state. Um, we have about $2 million, over $2 million in federal funding in Plainview ISD right now. Sharon Wright traveled more than 1,700 miles to bring one very important message to the Capitol. For this next school year, we've already been notified that we're going to have a reduction in federal funds. And so any reduction will affect staff. And when you affect staff, that affects students. Wright met with 19th District Congressman Randy Nagabauer to discuss the Elementary and Secondary Education Act. The act would provide federal funding for underperforming schools. We feel very strongly that we need to maintain formula funding so that we don't get into a situation where we're having to compete for grants in West Texas. Congressman Nagabauer was unavailable for comment, but a statement on his website says local districts should control how they run their schools. That's what he told Sharon Wright when she met with him. We are hopeful that any legislation that goes forward from here, uh, number one, keeps kids at the heart because that's what, what we're all about in the elementary school. The ultimate purpose of this convention was to make sure that the funding provided by the No Child Left Behind Act is still available when the act expires in 2014. In Washington, I'm Lindsey Briggs, KAMR, NBC4 News. The ultimate goal of this convention is to make sure that the funding provided by the No Child Left Behind Act is still available when the act expires in 2014. In Washington, I'm Lindsey Briggs, KCIT, Fox 14 News at 9.